Hello, guys. Zuljin here, and welcome back to another episode of Crashlands. I hope you guys are having an awesome day today. Thanks so much for all the support on the Crashlands series, guys. As always, if you do enjoy the videos, make sure to give me some dap on that like button to show you support, and you can subscribe to the channel for more daily videos. So today, I'm out to get the fishing pole for the tundra, and I collected a little bit of materials off cam, not a whole bunch, but we got some slurbs to kill today. I do need to put together the glacier incubator incubator i'm sorry uh because i uh i went glacier hunting for a little while so i can get this so we can start uh, getting one domesticated for the i forgot what the name of this stuff is let's see what is that stuff um it's called glacier silk so the pet is probably going to be pretty cool too. I do want to try it out, even though I think slurbs are going to be awesome. If we take a look at the data and go to, let's see, glaciers give uh, ice resist and healing power. So I'm not too sure what's going to happen with healing power. Is that, do we actually use something like a potion and we get a bonus to healing? Because it's a percentage, so it's not like... Some sort of ability that they give, I don't think. I'm not too sure how that works. This, on the other hand, <laughs> this is a pretty darn good ability. Now, Time Warp Chance and Turbo Chance are both very small, but we both know how powerful they are. So, I'm excited to see what it's all about at any rate. Shirks, on the other hand, I'm not too... Uh, I'm not too excited about it. although I'm pretty sure we're going to need one sooner or later for some sort of... Uh, for some sort of... Uh, material that they provide. Uh, anyway, let's see. I have the incubator ready to go, but it's going to take me a little while to actually get an egg out. So let's take it and set it down. We'll just set it down right here. And then it's got, what, five minutes to go? That'll give us some time to kill some slurbs. Now, I just came from the upper right here. Let's go here. I want to be able to kill some slurbs and also probably harvest a little bit of diamonds from... Uh, the nearby glaciers. I don't know if this is too far out or not. Uh, it probably is. So I'm probably going to have to head south some. I'm thinking. Maybe not. Let's go here instead. I think that this is a better spot. I'm going to travel up to the right right here. And I think this is going to be a little bit safer. Because up there it's just like, it's almost death. <laughs> that was some of the hardest enemies in the tundra. I also need to collect a few more of these as I go. I'd like to get some potted plants of these. I don't know how many we're going to need, but these are what it takes for um, the stuff that comes out, the glacier, the slurry or whatever, the type of metal that they provide. Those things right there, that's what it takes to convert them. All right, also, I've been trying out a few good strategies. Check this out. <laughs> <laughs> D-Bot, baby. D-Bot and this leash is pretty insane because you can just get anywhere you want to. It's pretty dang incredible. I like it. Take that, suckers. <laughs> All right, it ended just in time. I need to get... need to watch out here. All right, there we go. Perfect. Ooh, that was close. Okay, so basically, D-Bot and this thing, I can't use D-Bot often, but it gives me invulnerability. So I could get on the opposite side of whatever I'm fighting and just smack it to death while this laser leash is just annihilating it. It's pretty darn good. Uh, so anyway, that's what I'm going to start using for a little while. It's going to be the, the target build that I'm using. All right, let's see what we can get here. I need to get an area where the slurbs are. Yeah, they usually hang out around here. Um, uh, let's do it. I don't know about this chicken thing. This seems pretty darn hard. I think we might have to leave that one alone. Just kill that slurb and I'm out. There we go. Yeah. What? I can't even tell if it's red or not. I don't know why it doesn't show that. All right, that's okay, though. All right, so you got to hit him. Go on the other side of it. Use the leash. There we go. Just like that. Let the leash cool down, and D-Bot's going to be up. And I'm just going to make a few of these things mad really quickly. Okay, 
We're ready to go now. <laughs> Insane, man. Insane. That's one thing about vomit. Vomit just kind of stays still. So it just, uh, it's incredible, man. All right, all right, all right, all right. Uh, let's see. I have eight out of ten of those things. So I need two more. And by that time, hopefully, my, um, uh, my egg will be hatched. This is gonna make some things mad. Yep, I knew it. I knew it. Oh, what kind of, uh, shrine is that? Uh, a regeneration shrine. Hey, nothing wrong with that. Still not a whole bunch of the... Those little slurbs. Where are four out... Wait, wait, hold on. Let me say that again. Wherefore out there, slurbs? Wherefore art thou? <laughs> Even. Uh, it's been a long time. Alright, we're starting to get into the unharvestable stuff here. I don't know if I'm going to find a whole bunch of slurbs out here. Here, slurby, slurby, slurby. That's a little bit of glacier stuff. Most of these little lifes or whatever you call them, lifts or leaf, are out here. Uh, the slurbs are in that other stuff that looks... It's kind of around the glaciers. But it's that bubbly stuff. This type of stuff is where they usually hang out. Although I'm not seeing any right here. Still pays to get these, though. Oh, we made him mad. So far, so good. Except for the, <laughs> the slurbs. I am getting a lot of these. Alright. Every once in a while, they'll give you, like, three diamonds and stuff. Okay, oh, by the way, these blaster crabs come out at night. Like, and they are, they are pretty tough, man. Watch this, watch this ability. You yeah, see that? <laughs> they, like, blast off. It's pretty scary. They do a lot of damage, too. They're strong. I did kill a couple of them, I believe. I forgot what they're weak against, but... Alright, it doesn't seem like there's a whole bunch of slurbs out here, you guys. Let's see, where can we go? Where can we go to get to more slurbs? Let's try... Uh, we're almost at Persuader's point here. Let's, let's, well, let's go here and then we'll head southwest from here. Alright, where are you slurbs? I'm thinking there's got to be some around here somewhere. It's hard for me to tell. Oh, this is the green stuff. I don't know if this is the right spot either. I don't think we're going to find a whole lot of slurps out here. Well, hold on. Let me check this area. Anything? Come on. There's got to be some around here. Why are they so hard to find right now? Here we go. Here's one at least. All right. He only hit me once, thankfully. There was just one slurb right here. That's all. You gotta be kidding me. Um. Hmm. Let's try here, and then if not, I'm gonna go closer to like where I was at first. Yeah, hardly nothing, man. Okay, let's go... I'm gonna go here. So that's where I was earlier. I'm gonna kind of make the round right here. There was some slurps here earlier. Hopefully the respawns are pretty regular. Here we go. That's what I'm talking about. Oh. Ouch. <laughs> I knew I was kind of milking it. <laughs> Took it too far. These are the hard slurps. 
Poison was doing more damage than the heal could. <laughs> All right. Well, we found him. We were complaining. Can we get uh, can we get this out yet? We got it. We'll try him out. What are we gonna name him? Glazer. How about Fraser? F or a S I E or I think is the way you spell Fraser. If not, that'll work. Okay, Fraser, you want to come with me? Come on, let's try you out. Vomit, sit tight, buddy. We're gonna come back for you. All right, let's see here. Yeah, I want to try out Fraser, man. Let's try him out. Okay, uh, we need to go back to um, where was my body? Right there. Right there. Okay, we're gonna try this again. Okay, that's just a um, that's just a regular one. Let's try that out. How does that work, man? Oh, it hits pretty good. <laughs> It hits pretty good. It's actually really, really good with the uh, the laser light already. The leash. Ouch. <laughs> Get him, Glee. Get him, Frazier. Oh, wow. Well, I'll tell you what. I did get another Slurp Spawn. That's good. And Slurp Magnets. Uh, but he's he's not ready yet, yo. He is not ready yet. Not even close. Vomit does a lot more damage than he does right now. Okay. That's okay, though. That's okay. That's a good deal. Uh, let's get Vomit. But we are going to see what we need to get some of this out. We only need a couple of them. Ah, some of this. Okay. Let's get two of those. And that'll be enough for the fishing pole. And I think all we need is like one more slurp spine to be able to get this fishing pole. All right. No, we have everything. Great. Very, very, very good. Ah, it's about time. All right. Next, we're going to need to get this. No, it's not that thing. No, this thing. Yes. Yeah. Super fishing pole 2000. All right, let's track this. So, what are we gonna need? We need some vent sleepers, which is a something in the water. We need the carabone, which means we need some of these potted plants. Let's uh, let's put some of these potted plants together right now. Uh, build. So these take a lot. These are smash blossom trunks. So it wouldn't it wouldn't hurt to go grab some smash blossoms to get a few more of these. Uh, potted parapods online. Uh, let's grab these. Uh, we're not going to focus too much on it, but I definitely want to put some together. All right. Smash blossoms. I'm going it, to... It'll be able to get some seeds too. Oh, maybe I need to take this out of the way before I get to it. All right, let's get just a few more of these. What do I need? Nine of those, um... What is it? The Smash Blossom Trunks. Okay, and I get, like, one or two from each of them. That's not too bad. Okay, pretty good. Okay. And after I get, like, one or two more, it'll be good. And I'll do... I'll start doing some fishing here. Ah, oh, <laughs> that was close, man. All right, that should be enough for one more, I do believe. And I really don't need that many more of these. Okay, let's go see what we got here. Kind of a bad place to put a door, huh? Okay. And we would need seven more to make another one. Yeah, that's good. Four is four is optimal for now. I'll smash a smash blossom every once in a while when I'm running around. But these parapods will kind of help me supplement that. And I still have like 11 left to use right now. Okay. Let's put these down. What is that? A Vlappy. Oh, okay. My bad. 
I was like, what is that even? Okay, cool. So these will start growing. That'll be pretty good. Um, I do have some Smash Blossom seeds. I don't have any more uh, Harvest Bomb MK4s. Why is this out here? All right. Yeah, those Mark Three. I tried the uh, the Mark Threes earlier, and they do not harvest the Smash Blossoms or these things, as a matter of fact. So I'm gonna need to plant some. Okay, so I should be able to plant. Let's see, ten. Pretty good. All right, and I'll need one more um, Mark Four, but that's okay. Uh, so. What do we need now? What's the what's the thing that we should probably go for? We should probably go for fishing here. Um, so, I don't know where the best spots to fish are. We were finding some over here where we were, right? That's some of that green stuff. We don't need to go there. I think we probably should head, like, northwest of GHQ. And just look for some fish spots along the way. Uh, let's see here. There's one right there. There's two right here. In a good spot. Okay. Still nothing, um, no vent seekers. Vent seekers is really what we need here. Ice skate? <laughs> what? <laughs> Alright, vent seekers is what I need. Come on, guys, gather up here. I don't know, like, how rare they are or whatever. I'm gonna pull up in just a second here. Alright, did I get any? A squetty, an ice skate? Alright, still nothing. I wonder what those guys want with that quest here. All right, I did get some sort of schematic brain boost potion. That seems kind of cool. All right, I got an ice skate. I still didn't get uh I still didn't get one of those things. Okay. First, let's see what he wants. Look at those things. True demon skin foot wraps. This is one of the quests we had. I never thought did you see any more than one demon? Fortunately, no. I didn't seem it didn't seem very threatening. I'm sure that was a young one. Good on you, Flux. We'll investigate those guys some more. Got to keep up with the fashion. All right. Uh, so if we head home, I really need to look at these vent seekers one more time to see what it says. Uh, wait. The snail-like beastly lives around boiling hot water vents deep in the bottom of the ocean. It shivers non-stop as soon as you pull it out the water. Huh. So this is not for fishing, actually. This is it boiling hot water. I didn't see any boiling hot water around here. Huh. Where in the world would you find boiling hot water in the glacier? I have no idea. Um, but it says when you pull it out of the water in the bottom of the ocean. Okay, well, I'm gonna I'm gonna continue to look around for him here because uh, I have pretty much everything else that I need. Well, not everything, but we can uh, we can build a few of these. And that should kind of help me there. Because uh, I know I'm going to need some. And we'll let these plants build up and stuff like that. Alright. So, since I haven't seen that, let's go as far out as we can. To like that green stuff. And I'll start looking at the water sections there. And see if there's any, um, if there's any of that stuff. Alright. Yeah, none of this water looks boiling. In fact, there's ice floating on it. Oh, you mad? Those are scary. Scary, scary, scary. They make that they make a crazy noise too. We might have we might need to hit some sort of um finish some sort of quest up. 
to go any further than that. It seems like we would have found it by now, though, right? What is that? Engorged Gulani? I've never seen any of this stuff, you guys. Oh, boy. It all looks very dangerous to me. Ah! Bye. <laughs> we don't trust. I'm not seeing anything that looks... See, remember like how in the savannah there was tar? So after a little while, when you went far enough out, water became tar. And that's what I'm thinking that the water might become if we go far enough out in the tundra. That's just what I'm thinking. Lord knows this would be the biomes though. So this looks kind of like a different type of water. Although I don't see anything for fishing spots. I'm going to keep searching here. It has to be something somewhere, right? Something somewhere. Ah, I see now. Okay, can I fish this? Okay. We're fishing. Uh, no, ice skate. Seems like the same kind of water here. Ah, uh, I needed a smash blossom trunk, thank you. Okay, it doesn't look like these yield any kind of a different fish. I wonder if there's like a specific spot. Remember on uh, the last biome how there was one spot that you can only catch a certain kind of fish? That might be it too. Let's go up a little bit further north. I'm going to try to fish at this spot, too. There's definitely something there. This is actually worth it. Oh, what is that? Oh, that's new. That is an elixir of concussions? <laughs> or consciousness? I have no idea. Okay. All right. And that was a squiddy. Yep. Uh, this does not look like... Either I'm not far enough or there's a specific place that will find that. Looks like the same kind of water, too. Let's try to catch one of these big ones and see. Okay. All right. Not one. Okay, so it's definitely... <laughs> it's definitely not a matter of distance. It would have to probably look like a different kind of water. Because we are very far out here. Let's see. Let's see how far I am. Exactly. Oh, yeah. We loaded up like 30 chunks, man. Oh, yeah. Okay. So, yeah. If we haven't found it yet, guys, I don't think it's out here. Um, I'm thinking that it's a specific place on the map. It's going to have to be, I think going to be a real specific place on the map that you can just fish from one or two holes you know yeah this has got to be it because another thing that wouldn't make sense is all these materials that I can get here I can't harvest any of them so I'm probably going to get the tools from the very workstation that I'm trying to build so that probably doesn't make sense it's probably a quest but I'm going to dig a little bit further into that but that'll have to be next episode you guys I hope y'all enjoyed this one if you did don't forget to give me some dap on that like button to show you support for the series guys and you can subscribe to the channel for more daily videos thanks so much for watching as always this is Uljin signing off and we'll see you next time